And Stephen Stills did not invent this riff. Show 97. It's going to be a heck of a show. Why is it going to be a heck of a show? Or what am I talking about? Well, I'm going to take pieces of old shows. Songs that really needed some help as far as the way they sounded. Because I didn't know how to work any of the audio stuff back then. So, everything just sounded like it was recorded in a box or a studio. A studio is a sort of box. Any house is a sort of box, isn't it? And so I, um, 
I think they could be better. And it's not so much the performance as it is the way I've treated it in the editing process. And uh, these are the tools of the trade. Here is my editing room. Now, hard drive. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes, this is how we do it. The upper left is the sound, the right is the picture, on the bottom you put them together like stringing up beads. There's the. That's funny, it looked yellow like the wall. Okay, I'm going to turn this around. Here's looking at you. I hope you are enjoying show 97. I'm making a special kind of effort to do this show. I have a cold. Can you tell by my voice? It's probably a little hard to tell because the microphone here is so different. Which reminds me, I'd better take a break and see if this has been recording the sound. It's election day. We're all in breathless suspense. And I know there are people of all kinds of political persuasions watching this show. Or maybe not. Maybe every single one of the people watching this show actually agrees with me on a number of political subjects. That's a real, that's a real poser, as they say. Okay, let's see if this works now. Don't get dizzy. Okay, now there's a stop button. And I'll probably find it any second because I'll remember where I got started. Okay, I found out. It is working. I'll just throw the camera on the ground. <clears throat> okay, it is working. That's great. And now I'll just mount that over there. And I have no idea what you're seeing. I wonder if it's wide enough. Is it zoomed out? I think it's zoomed out. It's a small room. There's only so much you can see in here. This is where the show gets put together. When I listen to the show and I try and get the sound right, I put these headphones on. I saw that. I put these headphones on and this is how I listen to the show and figure out how it should sound. I think they're sounding better and better. One of today's main projects is to make old shows sound better than ever. I can also adjust the brightness because some of those old shows are too dark. And, of course, his hair is too long, and he's missing a tooth. One of my friends feels real bad about my doing so many shows without a tooth. Must have been at least 50 shows. I don't know. I think he thinks it didn't look good. What does he know? He knows a lot, actually. But he's from the Midwest and I'm from New York and I guess that's a little closer to England where it's common to have messed up teeth. Or is it still like that there? You know, 
Having a cold is a little like having invisible headphones on. Hell above and the heaven below All the trees are gone The rain makes such a lovely sound For those who are six feet underground The leaves were buried Lift me golden, tell me dark Hide from graveyard John The moon is full here of the night And I can bathe here in his light The leaves will This is going to be a heck of a session. It's going to be a heck of a show. I hope you like it. It'll definitely be different. And I'm working on a few new songs, which I will have mm -hmm. along with my voice back next time. I'm going to play you a Michael Hurley song. One of his loveliest songs. And... At the same time, if you, if you do listen to the, uh, I love this angle thing, this is great. Uh, if you listen to um, the last verse, you can see why he's not as commercial as some other singer-songwriters. But uh, Michael Hurley is loved by thousands of people. I mean, I, I envy all the cult artists, you know, I mean, Take Tom Waits. I mean, there's a lot of people who can't listen to him. You take Sting, ostensibly, theoretically, everybody likes him. Prince, Bruce Springsteen, who's the most popular people? Anyway, they're not my most popular people. As I said a few shows back, Alex Chilton is my Bruce Springsteen. And... Um, I'm waiting for somebody to ask me what that means, but it's true. It's true. It's true. Blazing Saddles. <sighs> oh, my stars. Kiss me once and kiss me twice. Give me a bit of paradise I don't need no blues hanging over my shoulder Give me a cold beer
love in the sky is different colors, baby, come and see. eclectic obsessor and I can't obsess over one thing forever like some people but I'm open-minded I think people can be closed-minded that's okay if you're closed-minded I respect that sort of I'm open to it, if that means anything. And another thing. <laughs> no, I, I have to go. Let's play a song.
till they're gone. presents more of me standing in front of a curtain singing songs to you, for you, singing songs to a machine for people. Yes, one of the key points in doing a show is staring at a piece of machinery and thinking about people. Yes, you. I'm talking about you. I know that you are people. You are actually people. You're not the person standing in this room next to the camera, pensively waiting for Charlie to do something else nutty. Nope. You're somebody else. You're sitting back in your chair. Don't spill that popcorn. And uh, you're waiting for me to do something. Well, I'll play you a song. It brings a tear to my eye when I begin Yes, that I'm around in 
rain was falling. But I'm so blue. Dear, without you, it keeps raining more and more. So. Thank you so much for watching show 97. It was experimental. Everything on this show is experimental. It's experimental in that I don't know how it'll come out. It's experimental in that we don't have the time to get the beta version together. We don't have a service pack for it. It just comes out, bugs and all. Did you ever look at the internet with an iPhone? I have. It's, it's like looking at an, a lot or a building or anything through the knot hole of a wooden fence. You look, uh, which I did when I was a kid, you look through the tiny little hole and you see the gigantic world out there. But you can only see it through this tiny little hole. Japan is a very interesting country. I have seen some things from Japan that are too crazy to do here. I, w I, watched a ch I watched a man try to consume a cheeseburger with 1,000 slices of American cheese on it. And it was a gigantic pile of cheese. He, he, he couldn't finish the whole thing either, by the way. I'm getting close. I'm getting close to the end of the show. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you come back next week. And I hope things go well in your life. I hope things go well in my life. I hope things go well in general, and I hope the election comes out right. Gosh. Election coming up. By the time you see this, That'll be history. Mm. History. That's right. History happens all the time. And we don't know it's history until it's the only thing somebody remembers about that day. I sent my son for his birthday a copy of Life magazine from the week he was born. Well, thanks very much for watching Show 97. As they said in uh, Public Enemy, I wish I was a wishing well. As Raymond Chandler once said, hope is what keeps us alive. See you next week.